Well, I'm Fleur Horweg. I'm a researcher at Wageningen Livestock Research. And currently in the Netherlands, ZLTO and Wageningen Livestock Research are working on the Roadmap project. And we work on a case study in the Dutch turkey sector, which already has reduced their antimicrobial use drastically over the last few years. However, there's still quite a large variation of antimicrobial use between farms. And therefore the sector is interested in finding ways to uh, also reduce that even further. In the roadmap case study, we are working on uh, the three turkey farms with the coaching methodology. And uh, we already did this coaching methodology in uh, several pig farms in the Netherlands, in which we had good experiences with it. The most powerful aspect of this methodology is that the farmer is working together with the veterinarian and his advisors as a team on animal health and antimicrobial reduction. Instead of working individually, they are working as a team, which makes it very powerful. And in addition, uh, also a coach is involved in the process, which brings in structure in the decision-making process and is also uh, guiding the process into specific actions. The Dutch turkey sector has already reduced their antimicrobial use drastically over the last few years. So we now need to look for the finishing touches and really fine-tuning their management. Um, so usually when we use preventative measures, they are more difficult to interpret in terms of effectiveness, economic results and technical results. So when we use antimicrobials, we always know we have sick animals. When we treat them with antimicrobials, they will be cured. We know what it costs and we know what it delivers. So that makes it a very easy to assess measure. When we talk about preventative measures, they are part of a large and complex dynamic, making it very difficult to assess their effectiveness and also their costs. So when we work on fine tuning and trying to find ways for further reduction of antimicrobial use, we have to look for ways to assess and to see they are effective. So it's more challenging to evaluate the action points that farmers and vets and feed advisors take during the coaching trajectory. The project demonstrates that the turkey sector is working on antimicrobial use reduction and the reduction of antimicrobial resistance. And we are trying to do it uh, not with farm-specific solutions, as there is not one general solution for the whole turkey sector. In this way, we are trying to find ways to stimulate change, which we are trying to do with this project as well.